Hi ho, we haven't seen you in two months. Uh, good to be back. Um, we are playing Kings of War today. We're playing 2,000 points. Mm -hmm. uh, we're doing Northern Reliance versus... Um, undead. My, undead. My new COVID army. Um, all which is, painted, yeah. yeah. all painted over this uh, period of time. So oh, yeah. um, this is the first time out with them. Um, I'm not feeling particularly confident uh, with the list. Um, <laughs> they were just basically miniatures I had for an Age of Sigma army that was, um, yeah, stillborn. Yep. Um, so we were going to play push. 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 So we're going to have, uh, we're going to play the, plea, the tournament version of push, which is uh, we're going to have three objectives each. We place those after, and you can actually place them with units. Uh, we place them after um, the army is deployed. So you can actually assign and give those to units. At the end of turn, at the end of the game, uh, your, if your unit is more than half in the, your opponent's half of the table, uh, and you're holding one of those objective point, uh, tokens, including one of your own, or if you manage to steal one from your opponent, it is two points uh, for holding it in your opponent's half, or one point for holding it in your own half. Okay. okay. There is going to be one objective, also a seventh objective in the center of the board. Okay, so uh, my list is wraiths. So what I've done is um, I had Age of Sigma Army uh, Night Horns. It was like two of the boxes plus a couple of extra miniatures. Um, and um, they were sitting there doing nothing. Um, I recently, well, fairly recently, did a CK Studios. Um, airbrushing course, which was awesome fun. Yeah. Um, I really recommend it. And uh, what better to paint with uh, an airbrush than uh, ghosts? So, oh, there's where you got all your. That's, so yeah. the eye for the race. So yeah. um, uh, also, I uh, I was looking around for colors and stuff like that. I was thinking purple. I want to do purple. Yeah, purple's my wife's favorite color. So I want to do something purple. Nice. And um, I think I found Dana House. Um, hmm. Uh, video on YouTube uh, which had her doing pretty much what I wanted. What I've got is uh, I've got four regiments of wraiths. Um, everybody who uh, you know in the old edition they used to be killer. This one they're fairly solid. They're, they have a defense of six um, but really they're, uh, they're not very hitty but what they do have is they have fly, life leech, nimble, uh -huh. shambling, of course, strider, and crushing strength one. So they're kind of... Nice anvil. They're, they're, they're nice, they're nice. Yeah. So I've got four units of those, uh, four regiments. I have two uh, regiments of Soul Reaver Cavalry. Um, okay, they are really good. Yeah. Uh, I haven't given them anything. Um, no? No. Right. Um, okay, so then I have, uh, for characters, I have a Vampire Lord yeah. uh, on a mount. I have a Leech King yeah. with uh, heal six and uh, Shroud of the Saint which you do when you have heal. Yeah. Um, I have a necromancer. All his job to do is to surge things. And I have um, the key to my army, which is La Lady Alona. Uh, now, she has this ability where she can cast a spell on something and drag them forward. That's now, the key. Now, I that see. Synergies, okay. uh, synergizes yeah. with the surge. So uh, what I can do is I can pull with her yeah. and then surge with the, uh, the necromancer and uh, also the Leech King if necessary. Um, to get something, hopefully, maybe in the flank. Yeah, that's... So pull it out and hit it. So, you know, pulling strands of strands of uh, fate. Right. Is, is the way I kind of that's think of it. That's cool. Okay, so um, as for magic items, all I had was the Shroud of the Saint, I believe. a oh, Blade of Slashing. You know, you have a couple points left over. You've got a character that, that hits reliably normally. Yeah. Uh, and that's really it. So, your army. All right, so I've brought a fast and fun army today. Um, very low on the character count. I have Hrim, so good old Hrim here. He's my uh, my big giant here, because um, he just doesn't see the table enough. Uh, I brought an Ice Queen with the um, heal uh, spell as well as the Shroud, so she has heal eight. And I have a Thane with the banner that gives Rally one and Inspiring as well. So that's it for characters. I didn't go crazy on characters today. But what I did go is I went fast, fast and furious. I went uh, three units of wolves, all having an item. Um, one unit with the, having the Pathfinder, the other unit having the Jesse's Boots, the other unit having the um, uh, extra crushing strength. Uh, I have a, a horde of trolls, snow trolls, which gives them the uh, Dwarven Ale. So 
uh, that gives them headstrong. I have two units of dwarves. Uh, one of those units of dwarves has um, has the scrying gem, which gives me a little bit of you know deployment. Uh, mm -hmm. Where are you going? Mm -hmm. And then I have fire oil on the other regiment of dwarves. One of the units of dwarves has two-handed axes. I have two units of foxes. And then, of course, um, uh, Bard's favorite unit of all time, uh, the ice naiads with the, 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 the just wonderful speed bump that they are. Um, and they have the hammer of measured force, which will come in handy, I think, against those defense six, because I'll be wounding on fours. Mm. And that's that's my army, uh, twelve units, uh, and the, and it's all a majority of them moving pretty fast, so it should be fun. Yeah, it should be yeah, it should be interesting. This is going to be a, a fun. This. Okay. Okay. So here we go. Here we go. Those are your three loot counters. You will place them after we deploy, and you can give them to your units. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, are we rolling for sides, or are we doing lazy man sides? Um, no. I, I, I don't care. I don't care either. Okay, so let's. What we'll roll is see who has to def deploy first. How's okay. that? Okay. Okay. So I'm going to roll a dice. I rolled a one. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So and you rolled a one, and I have a matching dice. I rolled five. Five. So I. It's your choice. Do you want me to deploy one unit first? Oh, you've got the scrying gem. So I do. Uh, let's let's go. Uh, let's just just walk. Well, talk about it while we're uh, while we're doing this. Okay. So of course, what the scrying gem is for those of you out there who forget, or it's been a while. Uh, the first time Bard places a unit, he will be placing D three plus one instead of just one. So I'm guessing you're going to have me deploy a unit first. Um, so I will. My deployment zone is going to be here. Not sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm just seeing which volume control I am. There we go. Test, there we test, go. test. Yep, yep. Just want to turn you down a little bit. There we go. All right. Okay. So I am going to put a unit of foxes over here. Okay. Foxes do have Pathfinder, so actually I'll put them right in the woods. Okay. All right. Well. Now, I will roll, mm -hmm. so you will be placing not one unit, but four units for your four first Four units placement. first. Okay, well, you know what? I am okay with that. You're okay with that? I'm okay <laughs> with that. I don't care. <laughs> who are you? You, you're telling someone who cares. All right, so... Um, okay, so um, I'm going to... So 12 inches on. I'm going to just sit them on top of the fence there. I'm going nice. to roll the fence over a little bit. Hopefully you can see the prettiness of the colors of my... Oh, yeah, look at that. So, f four units, huh? Four units. Well, then. Yeah, it was one of those situations where I just had points left over. Hmm. It's like, well, this seems like a good item to take. Yeah, it's, it sounds useful. Not that it really matters for me, because... No. I would have been deploying well after you anyways. How many units did you have? I, uh, no, no, I have, I think I have a lower unit count than you. Yeah, that's what, so I would have been deploying after you anyways. Yeah, so that's, uh, that's my four. So there you go, do your worst. Okay, so I will put a, uh, just for the viewers out there, this is impassable, that's impassable. We got two hills, two forests, uh, rough terrain, rough terrain. Now is this height zero or height one? Height zero. Height zero, yeah. So it's the, if you're in it, it provides cover, it doesn't provide any cover to the things which are behind it. Right. Okay. And I put a fox unit down right there. What does the fox say? Yep. Okay. Ooh, crack. Okay. I am going to put, um, let me see. Well, I'm going to put Lady Alona over here. And of course, as a reminder, you will be placing three objective markers with three units of your choice. Okay. Or you could you don't you don't have to carry them, but I would advise. Mm -hmm. um, okay. So, well, seems like I should probably place this here. So this is dwarf unit. This is the one with the scrying gem. Scrying. They gem. also have double-handed weapons, so they have crushing strength one. 
Okay then. Okay, all right. So um, I am going to put down my Leech King. There's the king. Okay. Here he goes. Okay. I'm putting down another unit of dwarves here, and this unit of dwarves has the fire oil, so it gives them crushing strength one versus a unit with regen. Okay. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. All right, okay, so I'm gonna put my necromancer over here. Okay. Well. <clears throat> okay. Well, we should probably match you by putting our bumper unit right here in the center. Because where else would I put it, right? And this is my unit of ice naiads. Okay. Okay, yep, yeah, pain in the ass that those guys are. Mm hmm. Okay, whoops. Oh, break these off. Okay, so here's my choice. These are those are your my favorite unit that you painted. The the color blending all the way up, the different colors, those look super cool. Yeah. If you um, can't see them, they're like five different colors. Yeah, I'll uh when I've uh, when I do the video edited version of this, I'll put a picture in there. Yeah. Okay, so Okay, well, you know what? I'm putting uh, I'm putting this up here. Okay. On the hill. On the hill. Alrighty. Yeah, it might be. I'm just gonna move him back a little bit. All right. Yeah. No. Okay, and I'm going to put a. Oh, we've got one dice there and one dice. Ah, uh, there we go. Make sure I'm not cheating here. That's fine there. That's fine there. That is fine there. Okay. So those are my snow trolls. Snow trolls. Okay. Okay then. Well, that's fair enough. Here's the idea. Shall I do it like Romans and put the cavalry on the wing? Or like Napoleon and put them all on the one wing. Yep. That's so, exactly. What's that? Oblong? What's it called? The. Uh, I do not know. Yeah, I forget. He, 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 Alexander used to do the same thing. He would focus all the cavalry on one flank and overpower on that flank. And Napoleon did the same. Now, if I remember rightly, one of the uh, Roman emperors um, ended up made a kicking a mobile cavalry force as uh, like like a big army, like a huge army of all cav. Of all cav. Okay, so that's uh, that's my unit of revenants over there. Not revenants. Um, okay. What are they called? They are called the Soul Reavers. Soul Reavers. Yeah, him. Well, this is Hrim. Here we are. Okay, and I'm going to put my vampire on horse right here. Ouch. Okay. Well. So what height have you been playing forests as in um, the UB thing? Oh, they, they count forests as unlimited height. Unlimited height? Okay. Yeah. Does that sound reasonable? That or? sounds reasonable. Yeah. Houses height six or? Houses, uh, they, all in Paschal Train, they've been putting it as unlimited height as okay. well okay. for tournament play. Okay, well that makes sense because it, well. Then there's no ambiguity and yeah. it's you know, right? Okay. But I, I'm whatever. Yeah. So that, that unit, mm -hmm. this unit here, mm -hmm. okay, and uh, has the, this is the one with a potion of the caterpillar. Okay. Okay. Caterpillar, that's why it has to be over there. Okay, I'm, I'm fully deployed. Oh, okay. Well, in that case then, so this is the unit with the uh, plus, one, plus one strength, so that gives them the, what's that called? The brew of strength. Brew of strength. Brew of strength. Okay. And, well, since all your cavalry are over there, I'm going to put the boots over here, and I will put, okay. She should be enough where she can inspire. And then he should be enough where he can inspire. Okay. And is that everything? That is everything. Well, that's so everything. now I can move these off the table. Okay. Is that visible? Hmm. 
Not really. I'm going to swap those dice out. Okay. You oh, think? right. Um, so, starting with, uh, it doesn't. I, I guess it doesn't matter uh, who I I placed first. So I, I will. Pl I placed first, right? The first unit. So I will put a objective marker with the foxes over here. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, hmm. The wolves over here. Mm-hmm. And the dwarves over here. Hey, I guess I'm sure I'm put. I shouldn't be doing all three at once. Sorry, I'll do it one at a one time. One at a time. Foxes. Foxes. Okay. Um, I'm going to put the my first one in this unit here. Okay. I'll put this one in the walls over here. Okay. Okay. Um, I am going to put my second one in this unit here. Okay. And a unit can have multiple, multiple, if you want. Okay. Um, I think I'm going to place that one here. Okay then. Okay. All right. Just like I showed you. And I'm placing my last one over here in that one. Okay. So right actually, now, actually, actually, I'm changing my mind. Okay. I'm going to place this one, that one. All right. So if the game were to end right now, the score would be 3-3 three, three because we each have an objective marker on our own side of the table uh, with three markers. Uh, if, I, you have to have it in the opponent's edge, don't that's you? That's for double. Oh, okay. That's for okay. double. So okay. if you can if you can kill one of my units in my mm -hmm. end of the table and steal the objective marker, yep. that's worth double for you. Yeah. Right? So that's a big one. Okay. Okay, that's why it's called push. Push. Because you don't want to be caught in your own end. Okay. Okay, uh, I guess we'll roll for... Uh, and this one can be claimed at any time mm -hmm. uh, to carry. Okay. 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 Four. Three. Three. I think... I think, I think, I think I should go first. Northern Alliance, turn one. Northern Alliance, turn one. Good luck, have fun, my friend. Here we go. I'm going to run these guys 16. So they're going to go up on the hill. And they get their nimble, so they're going to do a turn. Okay. Okay. That way they can balance on the hill. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. And these wolves, who are also nimble, are not going to go 18. They are also going to go and then turn. Okay. okay. They're carrying their objectives. Okay. Uh, the Naiads unfortunately cannot uh, go too fast here because they're starting on rough ground. All right. And this fella. Okay. <clears throat> I feel like this dwarf here, he's he's going to be the linchpin of this whole thing. So he's going to turn a little bit, and he's going to go four. Okay. Rim. Rim. Just go keep even with, keep a nice, healthy battle line. And these guys will march as well. Okay. They will turn. They can march because they have Pathfinder. All right, and just right up here. I can see your charge range is 16. Uh, for those guys? Or is it 14? Six, 16. 16, all right. Oh, so we were just out. Oh, actually, I think I'm okay with you charging them. Yeah, come get some foxes. Yeah, no. <laughs> uh, I have no shooting. Mm -hmm. I have no magic that will benefit me because basically heal and uh, ice, icy breath is not in range. That is my turn one. Okay.
Okay, so this is turn one, undead. Their first ever turn. First ever turn. Okay. Um, all right, so my guys have a speed of seven. So first one, turning. Uh, actually, I'm gonna have to move the lady first. Oh, actually, they're a smaller unit. All right, so seven. Now see, turn. Uh -huh. And I am going seven, and they are nimble. Oh, they're nimble, Turn. I forgot about that. Okay. She's an individual. Uh, her movement is normally Lady Lona. Her movement is seven, so she's got a 14 inch threat range. Okay, which is nowhere near enough. Okay, she's going to uh, move up. Uh, she will, does she have any spells? She does have some spells. Let's just turn her there and make her go her seven. So there. Okay. These guys are going to turn as well. And move their seven. There. Okay, this guy is going to turn. Necromancer. Oh. And move five because he's slow. Five. Okay, over there. Uh, these guys are going to turn. Look at that. And go seven. And there. Okay, this guy's going to turn. Uh, here's Leash King. He has a speed of seven. Um, and he has fly. Oh. Hmm. That's interesting. Okay, turn. And let's go to full seven. Um, okay. These guys are going to turn. Look at that. <clears throat> Reposition everybody. And go seven. Okay. Here's charge range. 14. 14, okay. That's good. Uh, one thing we could check for him. Does he have wild charge? I don't think he does. I think he's one of the few things that doesn't have wild okay. charge. All right. Um, what's his defense? Five. Five? Yep. And he's, he's fearless dash 20. Five. Okay. So just out of charge range for these guys. Uh, and it was 14, right? 14, so up to there. Yep. So I'm going to be safe. Yep. Uh, the only thing really is these little buggers. They're 20, right? No, they're only 16. They're 18. 16. Okay, well... Yeah, I'm alright with that. Okay, um, these guys are going to turn. One of my favorite things while he's doing this that came up a lot in uh, UB, mm -hmm. uh, and it, it seems to be a staple across uh, with Kings of War, which I really like, is when Bard's doing his stuff here, he says what his intent is. And that's really, I think, really important to, to do that in gaming. To say, yeah. my intention is not to be in range of your guy mm -hmm. so you can't charge me. So yep. as you say that, it's like, yeah, it's, I'm with it's you. It's fine. Yep. Okay, so those guys, are that's, that's just over 18 away. So you're good. Okay. All right, these fellow, this fellow's going to turn. Going to do, he's a vampire lord on a horse, he moves eight. So he's going to to there. Now he can march, can't he? He can march. Okay. Vampires can march. So, so yep. same with those soul calf. Yep. Okay. Okay. And these guys are going to turn 90 degrees. Okay. Um, should I turn 90 degrees? Should I? Are they nimble? No. Mm. I turn 90 degrees and I can move a bit as long as my leader point's not over here, I'm over here. Yep. I'm not on the hill. Um, What's their height? Um, so, height three, or I, I believe Cav is three. Are they just standard they're height standard three? Cap, yeah. yeah, so then they're, they're, so I can't see them. I think they count hills as height five? five? Four, three. Three? Hills are height three. Okay. Uh, so nothing could see him except for Arim. Okay, what I'm going to do, actually, I'm going to pull these guys back four. Right, to guard the flank. Okay. Okay, so I've moved all my stuff up. Okay, so now it is time for casting some spells. So first thing I'm going to do is Lady Ilona. Um, 
Oh, she's right in the charge path of your dudes. I didn't think that through very well. Um, okay, uh, she has... She's a beast though, isn't she? Mm, yeah, pretty much. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, but you still might like smack her being on the hill, crushing strength one. Yeah, I should have brought her over to here. Anyway, okay, so uh, what can I do? I can do enthrall, heal, three, lightning bolt, or surge three. Um, you know what? I'm thinking at this stage, I would rather surge. Surge three on that unit there. Okay. And that is two. Oh, nice. Number two. Okay. Okay. Uh, the Necromancer. Yep. He has uh, Surge 6. He's going to Surge this unit. Okay. I get one, two inches. Same thing. Two. Okay. So that's from him. Uh, the Leech King. He has Surge 10. Ooh. There's the guy. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, who's he surging? Uh, he's going to be surging the unit in front of him because he is the same height as uh, okay. the other guys. Yeah. So he will surge them as far as he can. One, two, three, four, five, six. So basically they'll hit right hit, at the back. Yep, hit to the back of this unit. Which is probably all you wanted. Which is what I wanted. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and my vampire lord. Mm, crushing strength draws, life leave for me to up. Okay, so uh, that is essentially my turn one. Wow, okay. Turn two, Northern Alliance. Turn two, Northern Alliance. Wow, okay. We've got some um, tactical maneuvering here. Okay, well, seeing as how I am nimble, mm -hmm. I'm going to take these wolves. I'm going to do a what amounts to basically a almost double pivot. So I'll use both of their pivots. Mm -hmm. So they're only going to go nine here. Okay. 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 And then these, so they'll take that objective with them. They see what's happening. They don't like it. And the wolves, they'll use one pivot. So. Okay, they'll use two pivots as well. They're and nimble. They eight. They're also nimble. And that is them yipping away and running away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, well. Can can the, can the vampire search? Mm -mm. No. Okay. So that is definitely what I want to do then. I want to force your hand. Okay. And the wolves, they will go enough so they're hiding behind the hill so you can't see them. Okay. Okay. And these fellas. Marching. Marching. At the double. At the double. Okay. Harim. Right there. Boom. Mm -hmm. Snow trolls. Can't march, but they can go here. These will go here. And mm -hmm. turn. Okay. Oh, and I should probably do something with those wolves. Now don't don't be silly here and give you a free charge on them. So they're 16, which is there. So they will go there, and they will go there. Yeah, two two thousand points. Who is it? Um, Russell. Oh, Christopher. Hey. <laughs> Okay, all right. So that's, is that the end of your turn? That's, we've got no combat. I have, oh, am I in range to Icy Breath? Uh, I can check that, because I may be in range. Um, I uh, am. From him? From Harim has an Icy Breath. Does he? And 
Uh, she has an icy breath, but Harim has an icy breath. Trouble is, I, uh, this is, uh, I should probably check that. Bear with me. Uh, sorry, folks. I've used Harim all of twice in, this is the second time I've ever used him. And the, actually, the only time I've used Harim mm -hmm. is against you. Yeah, and what happened? Oh, he got smoked. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The other arm, that other army is lots of shooting. This lots of shooting. Almost no shooting he at all. He ate cannonballs the entire game. Mm -hmm. In fact, I think he only lasted, was it three turns? Three turns. Does that sound right? Hmm. Okay, so he has Icy Breath 12. Okay. So he will use the 12. Is it supposed to be like 10 inch range, if I remember rightly? Oh, isn't it? Isn't it 12? It's not... No, I thought it was 10 inches. How often I use it. Is it only Because we had the same question when uh, we played before. Oh. So the number in brackets is the dice he Dot gets. number of dice, yeah. So, okay. Uh, so he is out of range anyways. Okay. But we're good. Okay, then. Oh, especially when I knock him like that. Okay. Uh, that's my turn. Okay. Turn two. Oh, can I, how uh, close do I have to be to claim the objective? Three, uh... Lou counters, I think you've got to be on top, on of, top it. of it. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Two, undead. Okay, so he, here's my question. You're going to run me down and beat me up, or I'm going to get the hell out of here? So, um, here's my thing. Don't know if you can keep running from me just because of my speed. Okay, so uh, I'm going to turn. I have Nimble. Yep. And... That's a beautiful thing about your army, though. It has it has its own built-in speed. Like, that's 14-inch yeah. charge range. So, yep. So, seven. Yep. To there. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh, she's going to... Being an individual, uh -huh. she gets her free turn. Yep. Okay. Um, and she's going to move up, uh, or she move up, she's got plenty, her movement is seven, so she's going to move up her, close to her seven. Mm. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, you're safe from charge, the wolves and the foxes are facing the yeah, wrong way. Yeah, it's just uh, those fellas. Um, there's lo lo lots of attacks coming from there. <laughs> you hate those guys. So, uh... <laughs> But she has, she a fly? She does not have fly. Okay, seven. Uh, if I can go to there, I can go to there. You know what? I'm just going to go over to there. Okay. That's all I need. Okay. Um, I'm going to check the range of the enthrall. 18 inches. That's enough range. Okay. Uh, this unit here is going to go forward an inch. One inch. I'm going to turn. And going to move another six inches. There. Okay. Okay. This unit is going to turn here. And move seven. There. Nice. Okay. This fella is going to move his flying of seven. Okay, over to seven. Let's get it this way. Otherwise, I'm going to end up further than I need to be. Uh, seven. Okay, and he will turn face that way. This guy's going to go his whole five. Okay, over to there. These guys are going to turn. Oh. And move seven and then turn 90 degrees there okay uh, these guys are going to turn I'm hoping I can get out of your range what's your range 14 14 okay it's going there uh, and then going to go there eight And push. he does not have wild charge. Okay. So you're you're good. Let's that back up. Okay. So he makes it there. Uh, these guys are going to turn this way. And 
go there eight. Let's see if I can get out from. Now bear in mind they're nimble. Yeah, it's uh, I'm, I'm doesn't matter so much. It's as long as I'm in your. Uh, it's these guys arc that I want yeah, to be out of. Yeah, so you'll be one on one. So I don't think I'm going to have a good arc here. I'm not going to go far enough. Um, okay, well. You are. I might as well start doing it. Charge! Charge! Foxes! Charge into the foxes. You could have minced them. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, this fella here, he's an individual. Um, oh, he is. Mm hmm. Ah. Uh, where's he going to go? Here's the thing. Does vampires, do they have mighty? Uh, vampire, yes, they do. Oh, yeah. Okay, uh, hmm, what's going to be my problem here? I could turn, I could move him up. Where do I need him? Not getting hit by something, that's the, that's the main thing. Okay, really what I should be doing is, uh, can't slow you down because I don't have a line of sight. You got your big giant, I start hitting him, your trolls are going to start hitting me which is in this flank is not good for me. Uh, you know what, discretion is the better part of Valor. Well, he doesn't have flanks, right? Because he's an individual. Oh, that's right, yeah. He doesn't have flanks, so it doesn't matter it does, where- It doesn't matter where you're here. No, he's- Okay. Well, you know what, may as well. He's turning, he's free, he's charging into Rim. He's charging Rim, right? Rim. Put some wounds on him. Boom. Yeah, put some wounds on well, it. Well, that guy's a beast. How many attacks does a vampire have? Um, I'm not sure, because I haven't played him yet. Yeah. Okay. Uh, the wolves cannot move nine inches with a token, only five. Oh, is that the wolves or anyone? Th this is push. Is that right, Dale? Oh, yeah, yeah. So anything A carrying... detail. Oh, okay. It's funny. It's not in the... It's not in the in the description of the the Push. of the mission but you're right actually now to come to think of that so but we've both done that so yeah. starting next turn yeah i guess okay because okay. we've both done it right like we've both we've, done it okay yeah thank you dale for Thanks, that dale. yeah good point um okay because the race would only be five as well uh the race would be five well th this wouldn't affect them because they move four <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> Well, it, it might actually have an effect because if I'm having any luck, I'll be uh, hitting some yes. in the flank here. But I guess. All right. Okay. So that's all my movement. Spell casting. First of all, she's going to enthrall those dwarves. So they'll go towards you? They will go sideways because I'm in your side arc. Oh, they don't march towards you? No. Nope. They, oh. they go depending on what arc I'm in. Oh. Okay. So enthrall, 18 inches. Pull directly forward if Bill's goes to the target front arc. Sideways. Directly sideways if you're in nice. side arc. Okay, and it is enthrall five. Okay, so pull them this way two, uh, two, two inches. Two inches. Yep. Okay. Boom. Okay. That's problematic. Yes. Okay, well, I don't know if it's going to work out for me. Okay, so the next thing is... Um, I wonder if I'm going to... Where am I going to have line of sight from? Hmm... Because uh, if I don't do this one, well, I could do this unit. Leader point of this one is in where? Front or flank? So that's in the front, right? That's center point, yep. Center, center point, point, and then my yeah, leader so point quarter is... Of that guy, yep, so it's in the front. So I don't want to do that unit. Okay, so that's the one you want. That's the one I want to do. Now, I'm going to have to really long bomb it from the nearest point is eight. Yep. So just over seven. Um, well, this didn't quite work out as, as well as I'd like. Well, even just getting them closer, though, I'm trying to run them over there to get them out of your way. Okay, so. so how far do these guys need to go before they're out of my line of sight? Well, actually, the Leech King, what's his height? Leech King, he has a height of two. So it's going to be blocked by the other one. So either, either go all or nothing, really. That's really all I have. For that uh, surge is 12 inches range. If they don't make it very far. Eh. All right, here we go. I'm going for the, uh, I'm going for the, how far? I'm gonna do five from the Necromancer. 
at them. Okay. And hopefully I won't roll too well. One, two. Two. That's pretty much perfect, I think. Two inches, you know what, where's this? Yeah. That's, uh, that's two inches right there. Okay, yeah. puts me to there. Yep. Okay. Okay, the individuals do not blo block line of sight, and I just see the unit. I think you just did it. If you yep. had gone ahead one more. Yep. But I think you're good. Okay. So now you what? Now this guy's One, two, three, got surge. Four, five, what? six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten. So you need five. six. Well, you got to oh, you oh, got to roll six. Six, yeah. So six out of ten is doable. Three, four, six. You seven, could do it. Eight. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Two, four, six, eight, ten. I got twelve. Yeah. Here we go. Ten. Let's go. Okay, so I get one, two, three. Not quite. Not what I <laughs> not what I needed. Okay. Man. Well that kind of sucks. Um, but you know what? It's still not you're not in it's still not still not all terrible. Yeah. But it would have been like uh, good to have gotten something over there. But you, as you were saying, Dale, the five inch move because carrying the tokens, that's something need really need to keep in mind. Yeah, anything, it reduces move down to five. So if you already have, like, again, probably because I play dwarves a lot, uh, it doesn't reduce their moves. Yeah. <laughs> right there. Okay, so I'm going to do my uh, my fellas, um, my Soul Reaver Cavalry, 20 attacks. Okay. Hitting on threes. Uh, yep, 20 attacks, hitting on threes. Here we go. So lots of hits. Nice. Then, and then, um, crushing strength one, thunderous charge one. But you're like two, uh, defense two or something. Two. So anyways. Two. All right. So you just need to double one it. Okay. Let's see. Because they are already <laughs> smoked. Double one. Oops, three and that. No, they're gone. Okay, they're Boom. gone. Okay. Okay. Um, so what they're going to do is they're going to go sideways to the left, D3. D3? Yep. Here we go. Two. 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 There we go. Okay. All right, so that's that for them. Okay, uh, next thing, my Vampire Lord. Oh, Vampire yeah. Lord has seven attacks. Two, four, six, seven. And he has a blade of slashing. So re-roll one of them. Re-roll one. Okay. Hitting on threes. Boom. All hits. All hit. Okay. Right. Vampire Lord, he has crushing strength two. Duelist. Now you don't have individual of your big dude, unfortunately. No. Nope. Oh, that would have been nasty. A defense five? Defense five. So you need threes. threes. Only three. Three wounds. Three wounds. Boom. And he is dash 20, so it doesn't matter. Okay, so I can't really do anything much against him. No. Okay, uh, well that didn't work out as good as I'd hoped, but not all bad. So, turn three, Northern Alliance. Turn three, Northern Alliance, okay. Already. Gonna do a dual charge mm -hmm. with the two wolves. Two wolves, okay. okay. All right, so. Warm. Warm. And warm. Oh, these are the heavy ones. These are the metal mantic ones. Boom. Okay. These guys will charge your uh, vampire. Does that work? Okay. Yep. You'd hit my vampire. But it, you don't have flanks. I'm counter charging with Harim as well. Mm hmm. Boom. Okay, RM. Uh, I think it's time that we turned the naiads. So the naiads will turn, so they pivot. Pivot onto the objective. Onto the objective. Nice. Okay. And these boys, they will also just turn to face. Yeah, probably a good idea for them. Because they'll, they'll block you out from flanking. Mm -hmm. And then the 
uh, trolls will turn and they will march just to here as well. So they're also on the objective. So basically, I guess at the end, I can claim it with either unit. Mm -hmm. um, he will go here. He will go here. Okay. All right, wolves. Right, so now this is where I gotta remember, I can only move five with these guys. Yep. So the foxes will just do an about face and use their nimble and do double turn. Mm -hmm. And they will actually go, because then your guys, does that guy have a, yes he does. So he can only go five as well. Mm -hmm. So he, the foxes are going to go, uh, do the full, and I'll just go five here. Okay, and the wolves, they will turn like that, and they will go here. Okay. So, Dale, I assume that uh, you can still charge 10 uh, with the movement of 5 if you've got the token. So your speed is 5. So, so your speed is 5, right? Okay. Um, well, that's it. That's what's going on. Okay. Uh, I have no shooting. Do I have magic? Uh, you haven't? Oh, yes, I will do heal on Harim. Okay. Okay, uh, two, four, six, seven, eight. And that gets him back. Okay. All right, now, uh, that's it for, we don't have shooting. I can't do icy breath in combat. So we'll, we'll do the wolves. The wolves are going to get 36 uh, in total. Oh, I have to do them separate. Yes. Have to do them separate. Okay. So uh, here is just the normal uh, one with just thunderous charge one. Okay. Okay. Hitting on threes. Mm -hmm. uh, take out all the misses. Mm, seeing lots of fives. Boom. Boom. Okay. And your defense? Five. Five. So I need fours with these guys. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Ooh. One, two, three. Three. Just three, three wounds so far. There. Okay. Okay. Now I'll do eighteen uh, with the ones with a potion of uh, brew of strength. Brew of strength. Okay. Here we go. Threes again. We go with the ones and twos. So, Dale, he said you can only move five. Does that include charging? All right. Now, these need threes. Because they have thunderous and crushing. Okay. Here we go. That's better. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. Ooh. Takes them up to 12. All right, you're probably going to break him. Here's the test. Okay. So six and 12 is 18. They are 15, 17. They are broken and gone. Whoa. Okay. Okay. So these wolves will turn and face and these wolves will also turn and face. Okay. Okay. Then we've got uh, they've got Harim there. Mm -hmm. He has... He has D6 plus 10 attacks. He's got 15 attacks. Ouch. Okay. Hitting on fours. Uh, oh, that's a lot of one. Okay. And of course, he's a giant, so he needs twos. Uh, okay, crushing strength four, four or something. Four, yeah. Uh, so seven. Okay. And then we have the dwarves, and the dwarves have twelve attacks. Does your guy have regen? Uh, does not have regeneration, but he does have life leech. So no, I think only if he has regen do I get mm -hmm. the fire oil thing. Okay. So I hit on uh, dwarves. I hit on fours, I believe. I don't know. Dwarves. Okay. 
Could be threes, but I'm, I doubt I, it. I'm That'd okay. Be, be a yeah, it's, it's in dwarf army that they get the threes. I think these guys are just they're cheap. And now I need fives. Okay, no charges longer than five inches unless you drop the token if you're carrying it. Really? What about surging? <laughs> yeah, probably surging. You're fine. Three more wounds on him. Three more wounds. Yeah. So how much did Harim do? Uh, Harim did. Oh, Harim did seven. So that's like ten total. Ten total. Oof. Uh, Reroll. Okay. Uh, Vampire Lord is 14, 16, 10. He's gone too. Oi. Okay. I was hoping for an extra turn of delay. Boom. Uh, so I guess, I guess I decide now who's dropping their tokens. Right? Because it's at the end of the phase. No, at the beginning of your turn, I think you do, you just say, I'm dropping the token and doing this. Okay, good. Good, because I would have, I would have obviously had I known that. I didn't realize you can't charge uh, with a loot token. I guess you're carrying it. So you can't march either. Ten, you can only go five. Are you sure, Dale? Let's. We need to look at that. I think Dale's talking out of his. I like Dale, but you know, <laughs> I think he just hits the whiskey or something. You know. Okay. I'm looking uh, on the page. Uh, I want to check that because uh, that sounds. Uh, wow. I mean, taking a loot counter is. Uh, Okay, so, uh, loot counters should always be played, oh, whatever, whatever. Okay, during the game, when one of your units sends phase, etc. A unit can drop loot counters, is carrying it at uh, start of any move, simply place a counter anywhere, completely within the footprint of the unit, then move the unit to normal. normal. Yep. And it says, while carrying a loot counter, a unit's speed is reduced to five. So your speed, you can still double it to march and, and, and uh, charge. It doesn't say there that you can't march or charge. Unless they FAQ'd that. Did they FAQ it? I don't know, but yeah, under normal, uh, there it doesn't, it just says your speed is reduced to five. Because I haven't seen that once in the UB. Yeah. And that's European players and yeah, American. Page 59. Page. It's just saying your speed's reduced. So that's speed still doubled. Uh, we're carrying a loot counter unit speed reduced to five unless it is uh, unless it is less than five in. Then it cannot be targeted by the wind blast and thrall or surge spells. You can't be targeted by surge. Nope. No. But you can march and, and you, charge. You lose fly, nimble. You lose fly and nimble. Oh, we <laughs> failed miserably. <laughs> okay, fly and nimble. I'm sorry. Just like forget us. Just. Put us on while you're painting. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, I, yeah. It doesn't say doesn't say about not being able to uh, charge double as far as I can see, no. Mr. Dale. All right. Okay. So. So you can still charge. You can still march. Um, but we. So the nice thing is that balanced out because your guys have nimble, my guys have nimble. Mm -hmm. So we were both doing it wrong. Yeah, so we're fine. I, now. I surged my guys up yeah, which, as well. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Yeah. Does she have line of sight to this unit? Uh, she she does. She does. Yeah. Okay. I'm doing a triple charge with this unit, her, and that. Oh, your, your oh your things. That's a problem. Okay. So, boom. Going triple. Get boom. over here. And, and her. Them. Yep. Okay. You're good. So that's over there. Yep. Okay. Uh, this unit is going to turn. And move five, because it has a counter. Because it has a counter, yeah. See, this is what happens when we spend so much time not playing. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> you forget the basics. Yeah. Although this is a mission that I, I we haven't played, have we? Like, uh, well, no. I the only loot it. one I played is the pillage one, or sorry, mm -hmm. raise, raise. Think. Can be targeted by the surge spell. Yeah. Okay then. All right. Well. Uh, he's going to move his seven inches. So the free move, the free pivot, mm -hmm. goes seven. And he's going to face that way. Okay. Actually, no one's going to face that way because he might need to search something. Uh, this guy is going to move his five. He's going to turn around. Um, so he's going to move over here a little bit. Okay. So slightly out of the way. Okay. Going to move. They're going to move their seven. 
Okay, uh, let's measure this out. Uh, I'm just going to watch out. I'm running into my own miniatures here and breaking them off the base. So seven would be there. Uh, they've got a charge of? Uh, Twelve, and they do have wild charge, so thirteen. So thirteen, so I believe. what I really need to do is I need to pivot them out a little bit. Okay, so then they're going to move their seven. Yes, they have a charge range of 13 for snow okay. trolls. Seven, okay. Uh, that would put me out. Sweet. Okay. Uh, oh, my, my apologies. My apologies. Mm -hmm. uh, I didn't declare who claimed Oh, those. okay, yeah. So if you want, I can just four, just, five, just, or six it. No, just do whatever you, the whatever naiads, you wanted. The nice. naiads would have been the, okay, the they're, logical They're fairly choice. tough. Okay. Yeah. Okay, uh, these guys are going to... Turn around. Uh, let's turn around a bit more, actually. And move their eight, which is basically all the way up to there. Boom. Just outside. Okay. Okay, so uh, that's all my movement. Magic. Um, he's going to surge this unit. Okay. Surge five for the Necromancer. Surge six, actually. And so just some nothing. Wow. Uh, you can keep those dice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, new dice. I'm not doing so well. Okay. Um, all right. Well, I've got, luckily I've got the backup surge from uh, the yeah. Leech King. Yeah. He's the 10, right? He's the 10. Yeah. Uh, one, two, three. You got to warm them up, man. You got you to gotta give them a bit of love there. Yeah. Three inches. Okay. So to there. Okay. okay. Well then, that's not quite what I wanted, but it's all right. Okay, um, Lady Alone is in melee, so she can't do anything. So let's do some let's do some attacks over here. Okay. So my wraiths have twelve attacks each. Ten, eleven, twelve. So you got and just both doing at the same time. Hitting or um, they've got life leash. I guess it doesn't matter, but I've only got this many dice anyway. Oh, okay. So well, I do have the rest of this. Right, right, right. But I'll just do it. Two. Okay, so the first unit, that one there. Okay. 12 attacks hitting on fours. Four. Four. Okay, four so far. Okay, crushing strength one. So defense fives. Oh, sorry. Defense four on these, so threes. So you need threes. So it was four? Yeah, they're only defense four because they have double hand. Yeah, double four hits. Uh, three. Three. Okay. And life leech doesn't matter. Okay, the next unit does the same, hitting on a four. Okay. Same thing, needing threes. Needing threes. Another four. Four, so up to seven. Okay, Lady Alona. She has uh, attacks eight. Okay. Two, four, six, seven. Four, six, eight. Hitting on threes. Okay. Mm. And then probably wounding on what though? Crushing strength two. So Crushing strength three. So twos. Another four, four wounds. Four more, so it's up to 11. Okay. What's their nerf? So they are. Okay. They are. Uh, he is closest part. Uh, so they are 15, 17. Okay, 15, 17. 15, 17. And that is? 15. 15. So they are wavered. Uh, they have fury yeah. and wild charge. Okay, good. Damn it. So wavered. So as long as I counter charge one of those units. So Dale says four. In the chat, what do I roll for the nerf check? You roll four. Four. He's he is a wizard. He is the he, wizard. He is the Dale wizard. Is the wizard. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh boy. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I'm just making sure the sound is okay. I might need to turn it up just a little bit more. I'm thinking. You're uh, on you or me or on, on me. both? Okay. On me. I was just a bit a little quieter. Okay. okay. Well, this is not going well. Um, and that is the end of my turn. Oh, I'm I think turn four. This is uh, I, I'm 
in terms of position, I'm out of position. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pop the boots on these guys because mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. I can charge, right? Okay. But So they're going to charge you in the side. Mm -hmm. I'm also going to counter charge with this unit. At the same unit? At the same unit. Okay. Okay. All right. So I need them to go away. So I pop the boots though. So J boots are popped. They okay. are popped. Okay. And then this this fella will come over and realign because he has fury, so I can just counter charge and give you that back. Fury is automatic. Automatic. Boo. As long only if I'm counter charging though, uh, it only works on counter charging. So, hang on, headstrong. Fury means you can only counter charge. Mm -hmm. Headstrong means you still can go. It's okay. a three up. Okay. Right. Okay. You, you fail on one or two. Regardless of yeah. Being uh, okay. Fury doesn't help you if you're if you're wavered and let's say in shooting. It, okay. Because you're not counter charging. Okay. So naiads, they they will charge. And how am I charging? Are those the flank? Yeah. You you your unit leader point is in the flank of that unit, so you would be charging in the Boom. flank. That could screw me, but you know what they say. Mm-hmm. Boom. Okay, and you're gonna have to line center center point of your unit to the middle of the side of mine. That look right. Um, let's see. You go ahead, line it up. If one, it's two, off. three. One, two, three. That looks about right. Right, right. Okay, perfect. Yep. Uh, the trolls. The trolls should really come over just to support and help. Oh, this yeah. is with them. them. Which that's the gamble. I could be literally handing you the token here. Uh, these trolls are going to turn mm -hmm. and try to protect the, the, oh, if I manage to kill you, if I manage to kill you, which their leadership is stinking good, isn't it? Uh, I think it's 14, 16. Okay. So no, it's just, just, sorry, dash 16. Dash 16. Okay. So the trolls, and then I need to be able to reform. So I will just go like that and go here. Okay then. Okay. And the thing. He will come over here, and then the witch, or the queen, she will come over here as well. And Arim, the turn. He's going to come seven. Dwarves. Dwarves will also go this way. Wolves. Wolves, they will take one pivot and they will go uh, 18 yeah Boom. there you go okay yeah and then these wolves will come up on the hill okay uh but foxes 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 They're going to march 10. So what else are they going to do? Okay. Mm -hmm. That's it. Now we do magic. I'm going to do heal eight. So I guess she has to turn to face them. You're going to do heal eight on those dwarves. Three, uh, six, seven, eight. We got uh, five saved there. Boo. Boo. Okay, down to six. Okay. Uh, Harim's can't shoot, use his ability. So now we just go straight to combat. All right, let's start here. So we've got 36 attacks. Okay. That's 40. I'll take away four red ones. It's actually a little warm, a little toasty in here. It is huh? warm, isn't it? Yeah. I'll open this door up. All right. Yeah, showing us 20, 24 in here. It's like it was cool today, so I put on a fall shirt. Yeah. All right. Here we go. You ready? 36, 36 dice. Hitting on threes. Thunderous charge one. Boots have been popped uh, Who's off. doing this? Them? Okay, Here. hitting on threes. Hitting on, oh. Lots of dice. Right. Okay, I will remove the crap. 
Oh, lots of ones. Lots of ones. Too many ones. That look good? Mm-hmm. Okay. Now... Crushing strength one? Uh, th yeah, thunderous one. So basically you have sixes, so fives. Mm -hmm. Oh boy, this could be bad. Fives. All right, so... Oh, out of all that corner, there's two. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it looks like quite a quite a few ended up coming through at the end. Two, two, four, six, eight, nine. nine. Okay. 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 And then I've got the dwarves, which are twelve attacks. Okay. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Hitting on fours. Uh, from where? Those guys, okay, yep. Okay. And they have crushing one on those okay, guys. Okay, so fives. So fives. One, no, oh, one. One more. So mm -hmm. it takes them to ten. Ten. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Don't break, dudes. So seven. Seven, 17, reroll. You need lower. Oh, nine. Bam. Bam. Okay. Okay. Uh, so I have to decide who gets these tokens, tokens. now. Oosh. Uh, I don't think it matters. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll give it to the wolves. I'll give it to the wolves. I don't want to give it to the wolves. <laughs> uh, I will give it to the wolves. Okay. So I get those. Yeah, let me I'll, I'll let you do it because then you can probably just dump them upside down, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. There you okay. go. Two in the wolves. Two in the wolves. I will do some repositioning. So these dwarves will turn to face this way. Mm hmm. Okay. They keep their item. Mm hmm. And then the wolves will that way. turn that way. Okay. Okay. And they are going to get hit hard. And then we have here. Okay. So the Naiads, uh, 50 attacks. Hitting on fours. Hitting on fours. So minus one because of the... Minus one, that's right. So minus one. So hitting on fives. Okay. Okay, here's um, 40 dice. I'm thinking you should get about five through. Five through? All the, in the, oh, all they the way. have the hammer though. Oh, that helps. Yes. That's going to help big time, mm -hmm. right? Okay. All right. So what I'm going to do is uh, I'll just, I'll, I'll remove the misses. So I'm hitting on fives. Yeah. Yeah. Always remove the misses. Yeah. Especially in this, because I'm hitting on fives. Yeah. And it's just so that your opponent can see the dice on the table. Yeah. Instead of like, oh, no, I got all these hits. It's like, oh. Can you Cheating McCheater is that again. Mm -hmm. That's the beauty of uh, the twitching and the YouTube, though, is that these guys get caught out, though, right? And when they do that stuff, maybe later, but it's still, it's like, um, did you see that? Because yeah. you know. All right, so that's pretty good, actually. That's okay. out of forty, so that's okay. two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. Two, four, six, five. 10, 14. 14. Okay, okay, so I have 10 more dice to roll though. Cause that's 14, 14, 14. 14 out of 40. Okay. Okay, so Four, far. Five, seven words. Okay, so here is 2, yeah, 4, 50, 50. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Here's 10, needing fives. Okay. Uh, only three, so that's 17 all up. 17 all up. Okay. Now I need fours. Eight to nine. Right. Ooh. Oh. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen. Whoa. Oh boy. Thirteen. Okay. 13. Okay, not good for me. Overperforming. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
Uh, here we go. Reroll. Okay. Need double one or close to it. Nope, gone. Oof. Okay. And they didn't have an item. There, see, that would have been better no. if they had the item. Uh, okay. So I will turn the naiads that way. This way. Okie dokie. Uh, no, I will leave them. I better leave them that way. Because if you surge into them, I'll just turn them like that and expose their flank. Hmm. Yeah, because you could win. You could win this game because of positioning. Oh, yeah, I, I still, I you still, see still it, right? win this from positioning. Yeah. yeah. So um, my sacrifices have been more sacrificial than I wanted, <laughs> but you know. <laughs> It's still, the game's still not over yet. Okay, so that's no. the end of your turn. Okay, so it is now turn four for the undead. So I need to start doing some measuring here. All right, so these guys are going to be out, I think, 16. Yeah, they're out. Okay. All right. Um, okay, these guys, 14. They're in. Excellent. Damn it. Okay, so um, these Sick. guys, double 10, charge they're going to be in. So I'm double charging uh, with these guys. So uh, what I'll do is I'll move him first. Okay, you know what? None of my healing has come into it yet because it's just been pick up, take away, pick up, take away. Yeah. For all, all of my fellas. So uh, what I really need is uh, I need some aspiring uh, to stay down this way. Okay. Um... Oh, these guys got fly anyway. That doesn't matter. Okay, Not if so... they don't have a to uh, these yeah, guys. Th don't. These guys don't need it. This one was the one which was going to be my worry. Oh, so yeah. that's all right. So double charge. Double charge. Boom. boom. Which is ah, there's and there was nothing I could do about that. Okay. Double charge. Boom. From there. Okay. Uh, all right. Those guys that's took some hurt. damage. That's gonna hurt. Okay. Sh Lady Alona is gonna charge that unit. Okay. Okay. Oh, I uh, remember she can't claim a counter. That's all right. She can guard it. Yes. Okay. 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 And uh, I will. Uh, I will do that with them. Okay. So um, these guys are starting to come after me. Um, so the best I can do is if you round that. Ouch. Yeah. So I don't know if I can get our range. Uh, your range is how far? 18. 18. 18. 18. 18. Which will get you to there. Uh, my eight will get me to there. You catch them. Um, my other alternative is to turn around and beg it, sacrifice some more. Mm. <laughs> okay. Um... Oh, there's wolves over there. Foxes, yeah. Foxes. They got one token. Oh yeah. Um, he's going to have to move out of the way. Yeah. But. Am I? I'm, I was gonna say, I'm yeah. out of range. Yeah. Way out of range. Oh, damn it. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to have to do this. Let's move this up. Yeah, you can turn around. Move you seven. This is eight points for you right here if you take this. Yeah, that's, that's, that's what I'm, I'm, I'm hoping. <laughs> okay, uh, those guys have a token. Right now, it would be, it would be like. Pivoted. The more I can clear that forest. Okay. Hmm. Okay, he is just going to come over here. May as well. Uh, and, uh, actually, you know what? He's going to double time it. So no casting from him? No, no casting from him. He's only got surge anyway. Right. So he's going to go to there. Um. <sighs> These guys here, my choices. If I stay where I am, I'm going to get smashed. I go forward, I turn, I'm going to give you my flank. I stay in place. It's going to get me there. Um, okay, so the best I can really do is eight going into there. I can't pivot and march because I do not have nimble. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry, buds. There we go. Screw you guys, all of you guys. No, no flanks for you. Okay. All right. So, uh, that is the end of that. Um, magic, 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 magic. Leech King uh, does not have anything which is going to be useful. Does not have anything that's going to be useful. Okay. Uh, she's in combat. Okay. So combat. Lady Alona. 
Boom. Lady Ilona, she has uh, eight attacks. Two, eight? Four, yep, oh, six, nasty. eight. Two, four, six, eight. Hitting on threes. Okay. And we'll break those dwarves. Boom. Eight, so two miss, so two six miss. hit. Crushing strength three. So you need twos. Twos. Reroll that one. Six. Okay. Boosh. 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 Six. Okay. What can I get for? Okay. Whoops. So that's I'll 12 and six is enough. Uh, Reroll re it. Okay, one well, second. I'm just gonna, I bump this, so I gotta get it back into place. Okay, and you can barely see what's going on on those dice. Damn it. Hmm. Okay. Okay, so I rolled a six. That's enough. So re-roll. Re-roll. Okay, let's see. Oh, Seven. Yeah. They are gone. Okay. Boom. So. So you... she's going to stand on a token. So she will be standing on that. I, um. Yeah, I just get it, right? So You just get it. Get it. So she's standing on the token. Okay. Uh, now my double attack on your wolves. This so, will hurt. So 12 attacks from each unit. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Okay. Okay, let's, can I do something here? Let's go. That might help with the lighting. Twelve attacks. Okay. Uh, hitting on fours. Yep. Now, if you get an above average roll here, this is going to hurt. Oh, okay. and that's, that's above average. Okay. Crushing strength one. So you need threes. Okay, now I got a cocked one there. So five, five wounds so far. Okay, okay. The next unit: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. Oh. But you just need to wound a few more. Okay. okay. Same thing: threes, threes. Three more. Three more, so puts them up to eight. What's their nerf? Uh, 13, 15. Eight, so I need seven. That's it. Break them. Six. So they're wavered? They are wavered. Right, so yeah, 14. Uh, to make sure I got that right. Wolves, Tundra Wolves are 13, 15, so they are wavered. Okay. So eight plus six, 14, yep, wavered. Oof. Story of my life. There we go. All right. Okay. That was so close. So close. Okay. Uh, that is the end of my turn four. Turn five, Northern Alliance. So can you just move those foxes? Uh, as t I think it's 10. Just hide in the corner there. Okay. Yep. 10. Perfect. Okay. And they might as well turn once because they're... Ni oh, no. They lose nimble. Yes. They lose nimble, yes, so they, they can't. Do. Okay. All right, so these wolves, uh, they're wavered. So the only thing they can do, correct, is to move back. That's and, right. And you don't have Thunder's Charge or anything like that? Nope. So can they drop? After they move, can they drop the... It's before you move. Oh, so they, they would basically drop them now, which would not be a good idea. So they will move back uh, as far as they can here. Up to the that line, okay. Okay. All right. All right. Here we go. Mm -hmm. All right. And now the Naiads again will charge. Uh, they will charge this unit in the flank. Okay. Because I can make it through. Uh, I, I can ignore her, can't I? Um, but even then, it doesn't matter because I line up. You have to go straight line, so you will hit her. I, I so don't you'll have to fight her first. And then if you... I have to go straight line, are you sure? Yeah, you have to go straight line. I thought that wasn't the case anymore. Mm, as far as I know, you have to go by the shortest route. The only thing you can go around is impossible terrain. Oh, I see. Does she have mighty? Uh, does she have mighty? Uh, she has mighty. So, so then I can't ignore her. No. So I have to hit her first. Mm -hmm. Okay, how far? Harim has 14. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, 
So Harim can actually hit her as well. But that really wouldn't work out. So 25 attacks on her. What's her nerve rate? Uh, her nerve is 14, 16. 14, 16. And she stops me from charging. It's an... Unless... Because yeah, you have to go straight ahead in a straight line. Unless I charge something else, correct? Yeah, you can go for somebody else, yeah. Uh, Naiads are... Naiads... He's got movement of six, you can make it. Movement of five, you're not fast enough. They're only five. Out with wild charge one. Just out. You need, uh, I think the closest was just over 11 and a bit. So just over 11. Oh, hang on. Let's get that thing. Oh yeah, just over, just over 11. That, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. Yeah, yeah you're right. Just you're right. Uh, wild charge one. So I can't charge those in the flank. Uh, okay. Which means I have to kill. Now, can I double charge her? Because he can see as well. He's got range. He's 14, and he can see over them. Mm, I think the size of your base. I'm not sure. Um, Dale, multi-charging an individual with a horde and a giant. She has mighty, so... Yeah, I'm just not just not sure of that. See, the thing is, you can't swap sides. Um, no, but he can still, he can make it, right? Yeah, I'm just, I'm just thinking, well, it's just like... Uh, Okay, center point. Now I'll have to move these guys out of the yeah, way. Yeah, yeah, but even then I'm just wondering how you're going to make it because you'd have to go, well, it doesn't matter. As you can see, you can do it. As long as you're within range, you can do it. Um, yeah, the only thing I can think of is if the um, the sizes of the unit, uh, like multi-charging individual, I'm not sure if that can be done. That's a, it's a very, it's, it's almost uh, obscure, isn't it? It's yeah. really obscure. Yeah, let me just check. See if we can find anything, because I know, uh, you know you, you've got that whole thing with frontage, but that's usually when you've got uh, when you've gone past two, right? So, right. Individual, individual. Yeah, I, I, I can't see why not. Individual. H thirty four. Four. Uh, range of thirty four. However, the individual fl line flush. If more than one enemy unit is charging the individual, declare all charges normal, move the first charging into combat, to contact. Um, then aligns to that unit and the charging unit moves to its final position. The remaining charging is then make contact. So yes, you can, multiple. Okay. Okay. So, in that, so this case, I, I need to move him out of the way. Mm -hmm. So, and he's an individual, so you can just do the whole, I, Okay. Uh, you want to be careful here because if you block your guys from positioning, you might end up blocking him because that center point, like which side is, who's going to end up on what side, right? So he's going to be, so he's going to end up on this side. They're going to end up on this side because I want them to be able to follow through into that flank. Okay. So, so he can move 10 total as a march. Yeah. So I probably should do that then is what you're saying, right? Yeah. Cause you want to make sure that there's enough space to fit the unit in total. Okay. So then she needs to move her five out of the way. Because the, the way you check this, where you go, is you, you do this, right? Yeah. From there to the leader points, okay? This leader point's over this side. So this unit's going to be on this side, he's going to be on that side. Right, okay. Okay. So basically, they go like that. Yeah. Mr. Yep. Giant goes like that. Okay. He has Strider. They're going to be hindered. Okay. Because they're charging yep. off that. Okay. Uh, they're there. Okay. Yeah. Thing is, I got to kill her otherwise. That's a problem. Okay. So, 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 so those wolves can charge your calf. Uh, these guys can also charge your calf. Okay. So my trolls are going to be hindered. And I both are hitting you in the front. So, boom, there, and boom, there, lining up equally. 
Oh, the, it's the troll sticks, sorry, but they are a little bit over. It's, mm -hmm. They overlap. Okay, yep. Uh, yep, no problem. Okay, so these dwarves are just gonna go four here. Mm -hmm. So they can, and then turn. These wolves, uh, these wolves are going to turn and they will march to the edge of this terrain because they don't have, they don't have Pathfinder. Okay. Uh, that's it. Okay. Uh, okay, melee time. Uh, oh, magic. Magic. Uh, I will try to heal them. Okay. okay. Uh, one, two, four, six, eight. All right. So one, two. Two. That's it. So two wounds off the wolves. So, okay. All right. All right. So now we have combat. Uh, let's do Harim. So he's D6 plus uh, 10. So he only gets 12. Ouch. Six, eight, ten, twelve. Hitting on fours. Ooh. I've worn out the, uh, the gold dice. Okay, but he needs twos to wound. Okay. Uh, there's two ones in there, so four wounds. Four. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Then we have the... Um, Ice science. Uh -huh. 25. Okay. Needing fives? Needing fives to hit. Okay. Eight. Get all the crap out of there. A few fives in there. Mm -hmm. And sixes. And sixes. Like, well, literally, black dice, half of them are sixes. <laughs> we like them. Uh, okay, so but now I need fours. Yep. Yeah, it was above average. There we go. Ah! Backfired. Three, four. One, two, three, four. Three, four. Four, yeah. Takes to eight. Okay, what's her nerve? Uh, 14, 16. So I can add one because of his brutal. Okay. Eight. Eight, and what's the total? 10, 15. She's wavered. And plus one? Uh, that's, uh, okay. So eight plus six. Eight plus, plus seven, seven plus eight, one is sixteen. Eight, 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 sixteen, so reroll. Okay. Roll lower, roll lower. Six, seven, eight, fifteen, wavered. Wavered. Ah, oh, that's exactly what you wanted. Uh, no, I didn't want waver. I wanted one less. <laughs> oh, I, right. wanted, I wanted to be clear. <laughs> uh, right. But that's better than uh, than nothing, right? Yep. Be better than uh, kicking the ass. So that's not too bad. Okay, and now we've got this over here. Okay, so snow trolls, 18 attacks, but they are hindered. Okay. Uh, okay, so I'm going to take away two here. Uh, let's try the red dice now. Okay, the snow trolls will try the red dice. Okay, so they're going to need fives. I don't, the snow, do trolls get strider? I don't know. Oh, Your trolls. I do not know these you can things. You can tell I use trolls so much. Yeah. Uh, snow trolls. They do not. They have vicious, though. They have they vicious? vicious, yes. So I need fives to hit you out of 18 attacks. Okay. Okay. All right, and I have crushing strength two and vicious, so I can re-roll. So threes. Threes, we're re-rolling ones. There's two mm. ones. Uh, this is a miss for sure, so two yep. hits so far, two yep. wounds so far, and... One more, one three. One more, three wounds. Okay, okay, three. Okay, and now the wolves. Wolves have 18 attacks, hitting on threes. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. No re rolls there. See, none of this really matters though, because it's all here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Thunder's charge one for these guys. Okay, so defense five. 
So, so fours. Hmm. So six. six more takes them to nine. Okay. And here's the test for them. Okay. They are 15, 17. Nine plus nine is 18. They're out of inspiring range. Bam. Okay. Okay. Cav chaff, best chaff. They, they <laughs> <laughs> the best chaff in the game. Okay. And then mm. these guys will also this reform. Missionary. Okay. Okay. Uh, and that is my turn five, right? My turn five? Your turn five. All right, my turn five. Well, the obvious here. Double, I, if I double charge the wolves, uh -huh. I should break them. I should be able to turn away and turn those guys. Okay. Okay. Hopefully that's the idea. Okay, so yep. double charge. Boom. I have um, Strider, so I don't give a shit about the fence being yep. in the way. Okay, uh, she has, uh, she's whatever it is, wavered, so she can't do anything. She doesn't have anything useful. Okay, all right. <laughs> okay, all right. So um, he is going to um, I move that person over there to go over to there. My real choice here is I've got like one turn to do this. Only choice I've got. Okay, uh, is is he Leech King Mighty? He is not. Neither of these guys are mighty, so no real point. Um, yeah. Okay, he's just going to move up to there. Okay, uh, he's going to move over to here with his whole five movement. Okay. Okay, you can move over there a bit. Yes, that way you can't fit in the gap. You're gonna have to fight him. Even though he's yielding. Okay, uh, that doesn't need to Okay. Okay. Oops. And is she doing anything, the wavered one? Yeah, um, she wasn't, uh, she can only go backwards, right? Right. Yeah, so, okay, so my idea was I was moving, I was gonna move him over here so yeah. he could heal her, but I moved him over too far. So, made a m the mistake there. Yeah, but you're blocking the back, so. So I'm blocking the, well, that's not really, oh. not really, because uh, you're killing easy, I think. Right. But the whole idea was he was actually going to be healing her up to give me another turn of her being a road. Oh, uh, so I made, a, I made a mistake there, because when I was doing it, I thought about it, quickly forgot about it. <laughs> so, all right. Okay, so um, that's all my movement. Uh, okay, so what can he do? Can, can he do anything useful? Leech King, uh, Surge 10, heal 6. Nothing to heal. Okay, uh, all right, so fighting time. Fighting time. Okay, so 12 attacks from the left unit. One, no two, no other magic? Uh, no. Two, okay. Four, six, eight, ten, twelve. 10, 12. Left unit, hitting on force. Yep. Ooh, that's a good roll. That's a good roll. You want Yeah, just, a... just one under, one over. Yep. Okay. And uh, wounding on threes now. Threes, crushing strength one. Yep, because they're normally fours. Okay, so two, four, six. Six, so they're they're well, yeah. Six up to twelve. Hitting with the other unit. Yep. Okay. Uh, two, yeah. Gonna need you to double twelve. one this. No, if I double one, I'm gonna, I'm gonna like. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> okay, and uh, some fours. And then threes and again. And then threes wound, yep. Uh, two two, two more. more. So got them up to 14. So they're they're almost devastated. Double ones, double, double ones. ones, double ones, no double ones. So reroll. Ten. It doesn't matter. Because uh, even, even matter. a one is 11. going to. Gone. Okay, so now you have a tough decision here. I have no tough decision. No? They're all going to the unit on the right. Okay. <laughs> no everything. tough decisions. Okay. Okay. All right, so uh, post combat maneuvers. Yep. D3 sideways. D3 sideways, got it. So one, one. inch. One inch. I could have I used more than one inch, but that's not too bad. Okay. One inch sideways. Right. Okay, uh, this unit here, 
yeah. is going to pivot. Just to block. Just to block. Okay. Okay. She's no longer wavered. Oh, that's true. Okay. Um, Killer. Okay, I think that might be the end of my turn five. Okay, turn six, Northern Alliance. Turn six, Northern Alliance. All right, so these uh, snow trolls there, mm -hmm. they will charge him. this guy. Okay. Okay. Because uh, now they, they can go around, correct? Yeah, you could pivot once more. Yeah, I can't see why you block. Because you don't, yeah. you, you don't block. As long right? as you can fit, you can do it. Yeah. Right. So, there. so boom. Okay. And I just fit as most yep. as I and can. Then, and then I align to you. You align to me. That's right. Okay. Okay. Uh, so then both of these again are going to charge, charge. that. Okay. Uh, the what's her name? What's her face? Yeah. The thing is actually going to charge these guys. Okay. okay. Uh, seems like because uh, he's an individual. It, it, uh, you're in the flank. Yeah, so he could fit. Um, as long as you've got a, a, at least can get to the side there. Well, my unit's blocking, I think. You can't go through and around because he can. I, as long as he can I, fit, right? I don't think he can go around. I think you still have to go. You still have to go if you're in this flank. Yeah. I don't know. Don't you measure? Are you in range? Do you have line of sight? To that, to the flank that you're going to. That's where it is. And I'm in your flank. Oh, because you're. Why? Yeah, because I'm, cause I'm pivoted. Okay. Do you have line of sight? Like you want to look from your side. Oh, so I can do that, correct? If I do that, because he's an individual. Yeah, it makes no difference to his line oh, of sight. Oh, okay. So, but let, just have a look from his uh, center point from his front line. It, does that have line of sight directly to my guy? To my my base. So. It's easy enough to eyeball. Yeah. I'm actually not touching your corner here, yeah. and I'm going underneath so, yeah, just, your. Just straight, straight look. All right. So from there, yep. You just have the. You just see just it. have it, right? Yep, but I don't it. get any double attacks. No. In fact, I don't know if I wanted the side, but. <laughs> yeah. Well, what do you got to lose, right? Yeah. At this okay. point, because so, you're yep. holding and how many the objectives? Like shitloads. Do I send her up to you, or you send her up to you're me? You're an individual. You send her up to me. I send her up to you. That's right. Okay. Yep. Okay. Mm. Uh, God, it's been so long. I really need to go over the rules again, and yeah. uh, it would have been better to prepare for this scenario <laughs> as well. The consensus that I see online, a lot of people, there's a lot of ambiguities in this edition because they've tweaked some things for the better, mm -hmm. but it ends up contradicting what was in the previous rules. And people get confused. You get confused, okay. right? It's not that anybody's trying oh, we're to. Just learning the new rules. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, so these guys are just going to march because mm -hmm. they can pivot once so mm -hmm. they'll march here mm -hmm. okay and then these guys will uh just go nine hey. uh, just, it's, it's, they're mm -hmm. way out of position that was really brilliant of you you pulled half my army out of the game which mm -hmm. is great as you said best chaff in the game yeah you're a fam cow <laughs> yeah same with my knights and my humans like people go for them well, yeah you, you have to you have to right yeah okay so uh, magic. Do I have magic? Uh, oh, she could move as well. So I suppose they could do that. Uh, yeah. Mm, do you have anybody to heal? No. Uh, no, but she does have. So she can go five. Mm -hmm. uh, and there's nobody with wounds, but she can do icy breath here. So she has icy breath ten. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Might as well. Uh, Okay. Now it's just your, that's the problem. It's just now it's sixes. Sixes. It's your defense. Okay. Now. One wound. One wound. Now the uh, benefit of it, you're frozen. Okay, so it's minus one to my movement. To your move. Okay. So we'll keep, uh, re remember that. Okay. And that's one for a nerve check. And I think that's it for shooting. Okay. So um, the free, the frozen, uh, do you need to do a wound or just a hit? You have to do a wound. Okay. You have to do a wound. Uh, yeah. Okay. Because the same with the bolt thrower as well. The bolt thrower, you have to do wound. Uh, okay, so that's it for magic. Mm -hmm. So now we got combat. Um, oh, I better do this in the right order. Okay. Do this. 
Okay, so we're gonna do against her first. Okay. So Harim. Now you do not you uh yes you are charging her, not counter charging. Right, because yep. yeah. Yep. So D six, uh so thirteen attacks. So four, five, six, seven oh, away. Okay. So hitting on fours. Mm-hmm. Out. Six hits. And twos to wound. Okay. She's good. Uh, four wounds. Uh, four wounds. Okay. Yeah. So it takes up to 12. All right. Then I got uh, okay. uh, Nyads. Nyads at full hitting capacity. Full hitting capacity. So One, two, three. Yeah, I four, think I'll lose five. them <laughs> They're hitting on fours. Ooh. There's a lot of ones and threes in there, yeah. I see. But. So it looks probably 50 50. Okay. And okay. Hammer, of me hammer of Measured Force. Comes in handy here. Oh, super handy. Just on that unit, that's a really good unit. Okay, fours. Two, four, six, seven more. Takes up to 21. So she's devastated. Yep. Okay, um, I might as well just, I gotta roll twice. Once. Yep, roll again. Double on it. No, nope, she's gone. Okay, so now I get to charge through. You get to, yeah, roll your, oops. Oh, so I guess I, I collect that. Because um, she, she can't carry it, right? She can only stand on it? She can stand on it, which, which means she doesn't have it. She can... If you kill a unit standing or guarding on it, though, I think I can collect it. I think I have to be holding it. Well, the nice thing is, you're gonna move I'm going to be moving. You're, you're going to be picking yeah. it up. I don't think you could pick it up normally, like if I'm just standing on it by killing me, because I don't actually have it. But because you're going to move up anyway at the end of uh, then I'll be able at to the end collect of the turn it. You get it whenever. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. This is it, it's a, the the loot one's a little different. Okay. Yeah. So starting with Harim, he's okay. going to. I, I guess I do them individually? Yes. Yep. Yeah, so, so Harim first. D6 forward. Three. Three. That enough. That, that looks like it's enough. It is enough. Yep. Okay. okay. So he's going to hit. Okay. Bam. Okay. Now, what a, what, now, this is an interesting situation. Yeah, you can't you can't uh, line up more. You're not going to be able to get the other unit in. So it's just, just going to be Harim. So then I'll just, I can reform, correct? Yep. So we will reform, which actually works out because this okay. is turn, what turn? Er, Your turn six. Six, oh, okay. Uh, okay, so now we have the trolls I'll do next. Okay. Okay. Okay, uh, now does he, he does line up though, doesn't he? Uh, no, because you did him first and then you did him. Okay, right. So. right. Because yeah, I, I see what you mean. Yep. Okay, so now the trolls. So I'm gonna take two away, 18 attacks. How how much nerve does this Wraith have? I need him to be... Uh, he's taken one damage so far. Yeah. Um, and uh, I should have taken... Oh, it doesn't matter. He can't waver him um, the, from the one damage from the Ice Breath. Right. The, into the shooting phase. But it doesn't matter because even double six would do nothing. Oh, I see. No, I'm sorry. I'm going against this fella. Oh, this one here? Yeah. Um, okay, so he is just a necromancer. He's 10-12 with a defense. Okay, ball. so that's what I need. Yeah, he's, he's, he's crunchy. Okay. Here we go. I need fours. Ooh, I need him to die. All right. Uh-oh. That's a lot of threes. There's one leader in there. Yeah, we roll that one. Okay, good. Okay. Now I have crushing strength two and vicious. Okay, so twos. Twos, re-rolling re ones. ones. Okay, so that's uh, four, five, six, seven. Okay, roll nerve. Okay. Here we go. That kills him. Uh, I have inspiring from the leech king, okay. so roll again. Uh, that's enough. Right. Okay. So I will pray, hope and pray. I'm gonna surge straight ahead D6. You need a high roll. Six into the Leech King. Okay. <laughs> All right. So boom. And 
Uh, they were frozen. Not that it's going to matter because they're not going anywhere. Right. Okay. So. What do they hit first? You know what? They hit that unit first. But you can't. You cannot line up to it because of the side. Oh. What happens here? I don't know. I. 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 I... You can't pivot into it. You know what? I think you, you're going to be able to hit something. I think you're going to have to be able to hit him. Hit him. Yeah. Boom. Okay, and uh, we'll just say hit him. Okay. That's bizarre, isn't it? That's the, yeah, that's... yeah, it's just little details. Yeah, because of the angle there. You can't form up with it. No. Nope. Because, you know, my guy's blocking. Um, so, but I think, I remember seeing something in the fact about if you're in an impossible position to charge, yeah. you, you need to make at least one unit chargeable. So then that guy, I'd that have guy. to get through yeah. him. Yeah. Okay, so same thing. I okay. do the same thing as before. Okay. So, meeting force. Too bad. Nope, I think you're going to be okay. Uh, what's his defense? Def same thing? Uh, defense of five. Uh, sorry, yeah, defense of five. So I need threes. Rerolling ones. Okay. There's a one. And there's three twos, one. that's good. And these are out of there. So only three wounds so far. Okay. Okay, and here's the rerolls. So only four wounds. Four wounds, okay. Okay. Okay, so you're going to need to roll off your nut. Nope. Not enough. So four Damn. wounds. Okay, so now I have Harim on the other unit. <laughs> yeah, four wounds on him. Okay. Oh, not on 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 him. Oh, sorry. On yeah, him. they're healthy as hell, which is going to get you the game, I think. So Harim gets uh, 15 attacks. That's beautiful. <laughs> That's <laughs> awesome. Uh, okay. Needing fours. Oh, not that one. Still might pull this out of my ass. I think you're gonna. It depends. If it goes to seven, I have a chance. But I think just because of that, the blocking there, which was well done, sir. Okay, now I need twos. Yeah. Everything's dispensable in the undead army. That's <laughs> the way I'm playing. It's like <laughs> bolt action with my Russians. Everything's dispensable <laughs> for go. the objective. <laughs> which was uh, well done. Nine. So nine. Nine wounds. Nine, on nine, nine. 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 Okay. So I add one, so it's like I've done ten. Ten. Well, you've, there's one on it already. Oh, so it, it's I, like eleven. Eleven. Uh, eleven fifteen. Fifteen. Not enough. Damn. They are fine. Okay. So it's eleven. Eleven. eleven wounds on that. Okay. Uh, your. Oh, so then my Thane. So my Thane. Thane. Thane can bugger off. Thane can bugger off here. All right. This is uh, so Thane has three attacks, and I think I cheaped out and I didn't give him the fox. So he has three attacks with crushing strength one. So hitting on threes, three hits. Okay. Wounding on fives. Okay. Uh, so three wounds. Three wounds. Okay. Okay. Which is good enough to make you disordered, which is nice. Yep. Three. And he do to charge, yeah. Okay, uh, no point rolling nerf because you can't roll enough to do anything. No. Your uh, yes. Turn six. <laughs> okay, so I've got to be clever here. Okay, so uh, what I'm going to do is uh, he this unit's going to counter charge. Yep. And then it has to line up. Then they line up. Then they line up. Yeah. Okay. That's all right. Um, he has regeneration. Yep. So he has regeneration five up and he's taken five damage. One, two, three, four, five. We get one back. Nice. Takes it to four. Okay. Okay. Um, and he's going to attacks. One attack. Uh, you know what? May as well. He's okay. going to counter attack then. Okay. Which will prevent that the, me the following through thing, right? Uh, yeah, because yes. you're just counter charging. Yeah. Um, this okay. Is brilliant. Okay. All right. This unit here. I really don't have much I can do except for move five inches to get the hell out. Try and get the hell out of dodge. Right. And uh, make it so you can't overrun to get to me. 
which is seems fair. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna go. Oh wait, he doesn't have. Uh, this guy does not have mighty. So as long as I can make it past him, I can charge through. Yeah, you, you just have to. Ooh, well, no. You can move right through. You, yeah, you'd have to disengage, and then you could charge. Um, so, so charge. So what I'm. You may want to move so that I can't do that. So I yeah. can't line okay, up. Okay, so yeah, that would make right? a bit of sense. So I kind of want you to, to win this. this yeah, is so cool. That, that would actually make more sense. Uh, be sound to do it that way because you could jut charge through through the only way i could really screw you with that is if i turn turn that way and go over to here put in mm. does that these guys have nimble no i bet neither do you oh i have nimble no but, you but don't not from fly but i only need the one turn i need one turn boom. Oh, can yeah. you turn because you're engaged with me i just disengage disengage i move oh, a little yeah, bit yeah, turn yeah. move yeah okay um, now, if I manage to do that, for you to get to me, I'm just thinking, because you're going to have to pivot to clear your unit. Yep. Okay, which is your one pivot. Uh, I think my base is probably too big for me to get away with it. If there's a little bit more room, I might be able to squeeze around through there. Yeah. Now, here's the thing. What's, you, what's your range of your charge? 12? Of which guy? Uh, these guys. 11. 13. 13? Yeah. Okay, so I'm, there's no way in the world that I'm going to get a sufficient distance away. And here's the thing, um, if I give you that, yeah, if I give you, if I give you the rear, then that's a problem. Um, alternatively, I hit the Thane and turn around and hope that I can take the charge from your trolls. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, what else could I do? I can't really. Can you take? Can you take a charge from the trolls? I think you can. That's the thing. Well, because already, I'd be already, hindered, probably. Yeah, right? I've already taken three dead. Well, no, not if I counter charge your oh, dude there. The thing. Yeah, um, I think. And if I don't turn, then I'm going to get you the flank. That's definitely going to yeah. give you enough. Uh, and here's the other thing: it might end at the end of this turn. That's right. And you might not get the chance. Okay, and I have to be mostly in your side of the table, and I believe you I am are. Already. That's eight points right there. And so yeah, twenty-four. Even if I turn, I'm fine. You're fine. I'm gonna kill your thane, bastard. Countercharging the thane. Yeah, Countercharging the thane. Yeah. You rat bastard. Here, let's just. You're on that, but it's there. Yep. Yeah. And then um, you. Here, I'm putting it me. here, yeah, knowing so that it's, know it's there. there. Okay. All right. Okay. So that's. Here we go. Trying what we can. Okay. Counter charge, counter charge. charge. I love that. That's awesome. And uh, the, this this guy here was doing what he was going just, to do. Just to make me... There. Okay. So let's go. Uh, 12 attacks on him. Yep. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. All right. Hitting on 4s. Fours. 4s. Fours. Okay. That's really good. Okay. But you, you've got like stupid amount of nerve. And yeah. No, dash no, 20. No damage. He had damage, but he, he got healed. Okay. Okay, and what's that from? That's yours, I think, isn't it? So that, that was eleven from my uh, vampire. Lady. Vampire, so yeah, she's gone. Okay, so so you get crushing strength one, so you needed fours there. Okay, uh, crushing strength one, I need fours. So what do you got? One, two, three, four, four. Yeah. Boom. Okay, four on him. Okay, and uh, life leech. Um, they take any damage from anything? They must have. Oh, so they have eleven. They must have had eleven. And then I whiffed on the roll. Roll eleven. Yeah. Okay, I have uh, life leech one, so yeah. it goes down to ten, which means you're gonna break them. If that's uh, right, I rolled a four. Okay, plus 11 uh, nerve you... check on them. Yeah, on I him. can't. Doesn't uh, it doesn't waver. No. Nope. Okay. All right. Um, uh, these guys on your thing. Yep. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Okay. Okay. Uh, fours. Okay. And then defense five. Defense five. So fours. Uh, yep. One. One wound. Okay. One. So he is 12 14. So you can waver him. I can waver him, but. No. Okay, and you get one wound back. So it takes me down to two. Okay. Okay, not good there. enough. Okay, and uh, my uh, dude there. Try to smack, the, make smack the him with his one angry. attack. 
One nope. attack, Lich King, uh, melee of five does nothing. All right, that's the end of my turn six. Okay. You have the honors. Okay, so one, two, three, it stops, four, five, six. Yep. It's another another dice turn. Another turn. <laughs> Boom. I was hoping you would get that. Yeah. <laughs> I was kind of hoping we would just... You rolled a one, two, or three, you win. Yeah. Just stealing and, and, it. That yeah, was we'll, awesome. We'll see. Um, okay, so I'm just going to charge then. I yeah. will charge the snow trolls into uh, this fella. Boom. So, the, only, the only thing I can think of is when you've got people who have nimble and they do the corkscrew. Yeah. That's when they go around units like this. Because you'd be your one, you turn, you're 90 degrees, and you have to go, you know, you turn your 90 degrees because you're charging. Yeah. And you turn there. And then you, you get your extra turn from the nimble. Then you go in. Then you go. That's in. what they call the corkscrew. Yeah. You need a nimble unit to do that. Which I do, but yeah, just not them. Just not them. Okay. Uh. Okay. So counter charging. Counter charging. Counter -charging. Actually, counts as a charge because you didn't wound me. Yeah, he's not disordered. Not disordered, right? Yes. It's not the fact that I charge you. It's the fact that you're not disordered. Not disordered, right? Yes. Uh, well, the wolves can't do squat, so they're just going to turn and they're going to move out of the way. Yep. This will allow me mm. to march the naiads. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry, not march because I'm on there. And that'll get me enough in there to at least at least make the score respectable when mm -hmm. uh, counter charge. Yep. Uh, and counter charge. Okay. And... That's it. There's, there's, uh, there's nothing else. It's all hinges there. I have mm -hmm. to kill this guy. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, let's do Harim first. Uh, just for kicks and giggles. There's no point in. Uh, I guess I should probably heal. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. Might as well. One, two, two. Oh. Hey. Okay. Hey. Okay. All right, and we'll just go d6 plus 10, so 16. Oof. That helps. Yep. Okay, needing fours. Okay, and needing twos. Okay. Right. Oh, one more. Seven. Okay, plus brutal, so 17. basically double ones. Double ones, right? And, and no reroll because I don't. Oh yeah, there's a reroll right there. Yeah. Right? Okay, so they're gone. They're gone, but that doesn't matter. Yeah. It doesn't help you too much because oh. your right. thane is in the way for you following up if you were going to try they and follow have up into the unit. That. Yeah. Sorry, the naiads had their uh, original one. Uh, oh no, yeah, that was the one. That was the turn. Remember when I went through? I never decided. So I should four, five, or six it. One, two, three, they take it. Four, five, or six, he takes I it. I guess. Because that's, I think that's only fair. Uh, mm. One, two, three, four, five. So I did the Nyads have it? Whatever. What did I say? I'm, I'm, I'm I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. Okay, let's do it again. Okay. So one, two, three, he has it. Four, five, or six, the Nyads okay. have it. So the, the Nyads, Nyads have, have it. it. Okay. It means I'm going to lose eight, six, I think. Okay. <laughs> let's do this. Okay. 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 Did I do my regeneration for him last turn? For who? No, uh, I must have. I think so. Yeah, or, you, or did you got else one back. Okay. Not enough. Here we go. Here we go. So this is fours. We're on four so far. Okay. Oh, I think we might catch him. Okay. And now crushing strength two with vicious. So I need threes, re-rolling ones. The re-roll, and mm -hmm. those are all wounds. Oh. So that's four, eight, nine with one re-roll. So that's 13. Okay, here's one more re-roll. Oh. Nope. So 13. That's 13. So double one it. And re-roll. Okay. Oh, he's gone. But okay. this is the key. What do I need? Get a, <laughs> in there, a two will get you in. A two. You ready? Oh, we're all 
it back in there. Five, okay, makes it boom. in. Boom. Boom, you hit. Oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, this is... Yep, I think you've done it. Just from that? Yep. So you've hit. All right. Boom. And you would be sliding over because it's oh, not impossible hell. terrain. There you go. Okay. Oh, now it's lots of them. Okay. That's game over. <laughs> <laughs> if I rolled a one there, you win. Mm. You realize that, right? Mm? If I rolled a one there, you yes. won. Okay, this is the trolls. Uh, boom, boom. That's a leader. Okay. Out, get out. Nope, nope. There, put all those down. These are all the misses. Quite a few misses in there. Because that's a, that's a full unit, isn't it? It's a fully fresh unit. My one? Yeah. It's like I've maybe a I've wound. I've taken two damage so far. Okay, yeah. Okay, there it is. Those, mm -hmm. are, those are the hits. Okay. And now I... Crushing strength two? Two. So you need fours. Fours, re-rolling ones. Okay. Okay, fours. There's a re-roll, there's a re-roll. One more re-roll. Another re-roll. But yep. these threes, there's quite a few threes in there. Yep. And twos. twos. Okay. They're gone. So that's two, four, six wounds with okay. three re-rolls. Oh, I've got a chance here. Okay. So seven Wounds. wounds in total. Takes them to nine. Okay. And now the Thane. Can the mighty Thane do something here? Hitting on threes. Nine so far. Uh, two hits. hits. Yep. Pressing strength one. So need five. fives. One more. So it takes up to 10. Just stay up. 16. So you need a six, seven. I have no inspiring around. That's enough. Oh. There you go. Good game. <laughs> Good game. Good game. Uh. Okay, so I almost pulled a really <laughs> cheeky oh. win out of there. It was awesome. Um, yeah, as I said, being undead, everything is dis uh, disposable. Um, yep. I like having cab units as, as chaff because you can't ignore them. Um, it almost, yeah. almost uh, got me the win by keeping your stuff over there trying to come around. Yep. Um, you know, knowing that the, uh, they weren't going to go offensive, all they had to do was delay, delay, delay. Yep. And um, hopefully I could pull it out, but... And I couldn't, you, you can't ignore it because those those Revenant Cav, mm -hmm. they hit like such a brick. Mm -hmm. 20 attacks, hitting on threes, amazing unit. So I couldn't ignore them, it really pulled. I said, I think I'm looking at it with the items, with everything else that you pulled over. You pulled m way more than their point cost. Yeah. yeah. Out of position. Mm -hmm. And they basically did nothing the rest of the game. Yeah, I tried getting there, you know, come around, uh, come through. Yeah. Um, yeah, so the way I saw it when we had our matchup uh, with the units that you had was you had so many fast units. Yeah. And then you had some tanky units. So the what I wanted to do was to see how much of your unit or your army I could eliminate, r remove out of the battle yep. by either baiting away yep, or just outrunning. Did. Yep. Um, when you put all your stuff in, in over here, yep. that was great for me because you had all that stuff over there plus your moment hitting stuff was over here, like yep. slightly over that side of the table. Yep. So when you put that over there, that was right into where I wanted to go. Because yep. where I wanted to go was turn and go this way. Go that way anyways. And, and so that worked out. Yep. Um, yeah, uh, I didn't feel that I was going to be able to get much out of my Revenant Cavalry um, for this mission, but mainly because of the number of fast units you had. Right. So that was uh, going to be fairly difficult. Um, the thing is, uh, yeah, reading the, reading the mission beforehand and all that, I'll just, yeah. put, I'll just put it down to what, two months of COVID, no, yeah, no yeah. time to play games? Yeah. Oh, no chance to play games. I think that's the second I've played that mission in its entirety, mm -hmm. ever. Yeah, yeah. Push. It's it's a uh, it's definitely a really cool mission. Uh, you know, it's definitely uh, and also looking at the rules for loot counters. Yeah. Uh, okay, it reduces your move to five. Can you charge? Can you march? Mm -hmm. I think you can, based on what we said. Yeah, you, you just speak five. I, but you just there, there might be a fact. Yeah. Yeah. But, so, but you I'm, lose nimble and you lose flying. Yeah. What I might do is mark. Anything that needs a fact or has the fact with a highlighter in the rule book. Good call. So I can say, okay, oh yeah, there's a difference here. Yeah. Um, 
So there was a, a few questions regarding maneuverability of units. I think, for example, when you had your snow trolls and that one dude there, yeah. maybe if like you were like over to the side or something, because whichever way you turned, yeah. you were still going to be near me. If you had a nimble unit, yeah. you get the two turns. So you could turn once, move away, turn the second time and move, which you know, is a corkscrew. Right, because so, um, they can do that, right? They can do that. Yeah. So I think that's, that's why you can't just go straight through and if you just happen to fit, because you could not turn to clear me because you were on me. Right. So if you'd been further back, you probably could have turned and then gone past me and then hit the unit. Right. As long as you cleared me. Okay. So okay, I think we might have been overthinking that. Maybe. Maybe. I, maybe. Again, yeah. I, I think, I think again, the problem is because you, you're, you know, it's been two months since we've, mm -hmm. and this is the way Kings of War should be played. I mean, as Dale mentioned that he has no, he had no interest and the UB just didn't interest him because this mm -hmm. is what Kings of War is. It's Table. a tabletop game. Yeah, it's way more fun. But, but also when you start playing complete strangers from all over the world, mm -hmm. everyone has different interpretations on the rules. Yeah, and I'm, I'm not I, trying yeah. to say that I'm always right. This is hard to communicate. It's hard online. to communicate and you're like, oh, okay, that seems reasonable. They yeah. made a good argument and then it throws you off when you play somebody and you're like, mm. well, that's not how... The same of every war game ever made. Ever made. made. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Regardless, it's like, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah I just need to uh, brush up on the rules again. Yeah. Um, no, so my army went as well as I thought it would. I had some, uh, I think early on, I had some terrible luck with, uh, with the amount of damage I was taking and my yeah. units were just crumbling immediately rather than holding me up that one extra turn. Yeah. So, you know, I was hoping for, you know, like, okay, just, just don't take them off immediately. Just like hit them, get them almost dead, then go again. But you, it was you, like, bang, you did one, bang, you did one. You don't anticipate a defense six unit will be one turn. Yeah. And that, and that, that's because I was spiking on my rolls. I was rolling mm. way above the, the curve. Right at the beginning, uh, yeah. And your plan for your army is for your anvil to hold, correct? And then just, your just, hammers just, come in. Well, for, for me, for this mission, was to neutralize as much of your army as I can and then come to the corner. Yeah, which you which I almost, almost, pulled, did. Off, almost <laughs> pulled off with cheeky, cheeky Eight tactics. points in one unit. Eight mm -hmm. points in that one unit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my, my placement of the tokens was stupid. Uh, it, giving, giving one of the objective tokens to a move four dwarf, yeah. not the best idea. And all putting them all over there like you said, yeah, being they are fairly slow. Like, they're like okay. You put it across a lot of ta a lot of units. Yeah. You got a lot of slower units. Yeah. Okay, but you've got your movement four dwarves. I possibly would have blood bowled it and put, put them all two in there. units of dwarves together. Give them and then just everything else smashes and opens a path for them. That's yeah. And, you know, yeah, that, that would have been a good plan like, actually. You know, just cage, cage up with the dwarves. Yeah. And um, you know, take take them through. This, I think this is a great mission for tournament play. Mm -hmm. once, once you start ironing out, uh, you know, it's almost like you need a little pamphlet. Reminder what loot counters do. Yeah. Reduce your move to five. Yep. yep. You lose this, you lose this. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, if, if I was going to do as a TO, that's what I'd probably say, just, you know, notes. Notes, for look at notes for loot, because it's thing. not objective tokens, it's loot counters only that it I'm does not, that. I'm not sure, that might be the first time I've played it. It's, yeah, this is the Maybe. first time I've ever played be. that mission on tabletop. Or it could just be old man's memory. I might have played it once before. No, you and I have never played it. Mm. And basically that pretty much is 75% of my mm. Kings of War games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, that was any, awesome, Any man. other thoughts? No, I really liked how your army played. It's You know what? It, it's funny because what are you building right now? My next one? Yeah. Romans. Romans. And Romans is a, is a like strong, crazy center. Yeah. Right? With some beautiful cab. Well, yeah, my, my, it's like a three layer center. So three layer I'll, center. I'll, I'll, be, I'll be having my three lines. Because you've got your, your legionnaries yeah, and then you've my got Hastati your. at the front, yeah. my um, principes and then in the veterans. middle, and then the, uh, the triarii in the back. In the back. That's so, going to be awesome. Uh, yeah, I'm like, it's 253 miniatures <sighs> to paint. Um, but it's going to look amazing, I think, when I when I uh, get done. I'm going to do it all with um, contrast paints. Are you? I'll, I'll zenithal prime it and uh, use contrast paints nice. on it, uh, just to speed it up. Um, it won't look the best, but you know what? From three feet away, looking at the table, you can't tell. Right? It's golden red, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, gold, red, silver, silver, red. Um, okay, so 
Now, I was gl I'm glad to have another game. I want yes. to play more. Um, I had the technical issues with the, the computer and you know, getting all the bits and pieces done up. Um, I'll have to do an edit of this and uh, you know, um, I'll just streamline, maybe edit out some of the, what are we doing here when we sit there for like three minutes talking about something and then we just decide that, oh yeah, well, we, it's how we thought it was at the beginning. Yeah. So save people some time watching. Yeah. Um, Okay, um, I have nothing else to Fantastic say. Fantastic game. No, awesome. Feels good to be out and about and playing again. Yep. Okay, well, thanks for watching. If you're watching, thanks, Dale, for the rules input. Uh